you learn about power in mediation and how we're going to balance things out and things like that. For me, it's more how we're going to educate the parties about power and about their power, because often, you know, power is very much two-dimensional, at least maybe even tri or you know multi-dimensional, and it's something that you know we can certainly. Um, if, if parties are educated about it, that actually empowers them as well, seeing that they have a certain amount of power. So we were talking yesterday about um, people involved in claims. So even the, the complainant sometimes has the most power and it's the manager that then ends up, you know, say a person puts in a bullying claim or sexual harassment or whatever, um, sometimes the that complainant is actually the more powerful one because this other person is under investigation or, or ends up on a stress claim or all of these other things. So it's a really important thing. Um, I think power is, is, is sometimes misunderstood by people.